Have you been losing sleep, wondering, searching for the answer to, what does the inside of the Ark look like today? Then your long-awaited hopes and dreams are now fulfilled. This is what it looks like. Today on St. Bridget's Irish Crafts, we will be making the Ark of Salvation. Now that it's mostly colored and cut out, let's look at what it all means and put it together so it looks like this. Find the piece that says Posca Media or Table of Preparation and cut it out. What do you think happens on this table? The priest prepares the gifts of Prospera bread and wine. Glue it in place. Attach the second piece overlapping. Glue on two icons. Now take the piece that says the Iconicon. This is where the priest vestments are kept, along with any books or liturgical items. Cut out the picture of the vestments and glue it in place. The table of preparation, along with the vestments, books, and liturgical items, used to be kept in a separate building called the Skevophilakian. You want to hear me say that again? Skevophilakian. Say it three times real quick. Skevophilakian, Skevophilakian, Skevophilakian. During the Divine Liturgy, a procession from the Skevophilakian carried the Gospel book into the church and then to the Bema. Today we call this the small entrance. <laughs> Another procession brought the gifts of bread and wine into the nave and then the bima. This is called the great entrance. By the 800s, the Table of Preparation and the Iconicon were brought inside the church, but we still do the processions. Find the picture that looks like a throne, cut it out, and glue it in the place that says Bishop's Throne. Hey, why does the bishop get a throne? I'm glad you asked, though you could have said it more humbly. In early churches, Semicircular benches like bleachers were on the back wall of the bima. 
These bleachers are called synthronon, which means with throne. The bishop's chair sat on top of the synthronon, so that during liturgy, seated on this chair with priests on both sides of him, he could see and be seen from behind the altar table as he preached. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? When churches began to be built with three apses, a one and a two and a three, the synthronon was no longer built and the bishop's throne was moved to the south of the solea. Attach the second piece overlapping. Glue on an icon. Now, let's put the sides on. Bend each of the tabs inward towards the pictures. Take small pieces of double sticky tape and put them on top of the tabs facing up. Line up the front point of the paper with the tip of the church and pinch the first tab onto the bottom of the ship. Then the next one and next one. Let's repeat on the other side. Bend each of the tabs inward towards the pictures. Take small pieces of double sticky tape and put them on top of the tabs facing up. Line up the front point of the paper with the tip of the church and pinch the first tab onto the bottom of the ship. Then the next one and next one. Now take a piece of double sticky tape, put it on one of the pieces at the front, close to the bottom, and pinch them together. Take another piece, place it further up, and pinch together.
Now, let's put on our equinostasis. Cut out the icon for the name of the church. Then glue it in place. Bend tabs back and place a piece of tape on top of each side. Attach the Iconostasis icon stand along the line that separates the solea, which means elevated place, from the bima. Then pinch into place. Now the doors into the nave. Bend tabs and place a piece of tape on each side. Pinch into place. Now we're cutting out the front door. Along the edges where it says bend, we bend back. Then we put double sticky tape on. and attach it to the very edge of the arc. Dear Gwith. Dear Zmir Gwith. This is Ireland calling. What are you doing with all of our crafts? St. Bridget's Irish crafts are for everyone, not just the Irish people. Oh, did I tell you why my friend likes to go to Disney World so much? No. Because he's goofy. Wow. And that brings us to the end of our show. Until next time on St. Bridget's Irish Crafts. May the road rise up to meet you. May the wind always be at your back. May the sun shine warm upon your face and rains fall soft upon your fields. And until we meet again, may God hold you in the palm of his hand. Are you related to Archbishop Demetrios? Mm, no, not that I am aware of. Uh, why do you ask?